Our time of confession and assurance is prompted by Psalm 25, verses 1 to 7, in which we read, In you, Lord my God, I put my trust. I trust in you. Do not let me be put to shame, nor let my enemies triumph over me. No one who hopes in you will ever be put to shame, but shame will come on those who are treacherous without cause. Show me your ways, Lord. Teach me your paths. Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God my Savior, and my hope is in you all day long. Remember, Lord, your great mercy and love for they are from of old. Do not remember the sins of my youth and my rebellious ways. According to your love, remember me. For you, Lord, our good. Brothers and sisters, we might be tempted to look at this psalm and say, Yes, I've matured so much. I don't need to worry about the sins of my youth anymore because God has forgiven those. But really, compared to God, we are all youths, which may be comforting in some ways, but nonetheless it is also convicting if we remember that really the sins of our youth are not removed from us. That really our rebellious ways have not been obliterated completely. So let us come to God in prayer and ask for his forgiveness. Oh God, thank you for being with us this morning. Thank you for your love for us. Thank you for your faithfulness to us, O oh God. Thank you, O oh God, that we can trust in you. Lord, as we come before you, we hear the psalmist saying, asking for you to remember not his sins and his rebellious ways. Lord, we ask to that you would remove our sins and our rebellion as far as the east is from the west. And so, Lord, as we take some time to silently confess to you the ways in which we have rebelled against you, the ways in which we have sinned against you, Lord, please open our hearts that we may know what it is we need to confess and that we also may lay those things honestly before you. So, Lord, hear our prayers. Thank you, O oh God. Thank you for hearing our prayers. And Lord, thank you for remembering your love for us. For Lord, you are good. Lord, we praise your name. Through Jesus, your Son, and in the power of your Spirit. Amen.